Welcome back, Monsketeers, to another Radnorock Classic Cartoon Commentary. Today, something a little more unique than normal. We're venturing back to 1988, September 1988 to be precise. And we're hanging out with Figment, the little purple dragon, to learn if dragons dream. Do dragons dream? Directed by Robin Allison Smalley. Written by Jamie Simmons and starring Billy Barty as Figment, the little purple dragon. And if you are unfamiliar with Figment, well, you're in luck. You can go give a listen to our Radnorock Retrospective podcast where you can learn everything you didn't know you wanted to know about that little guy right there, Figment the Dragon. Oh, oh, starting with a song, and you know that's the way to my heart. <sighs> and mix that with Figment. It's Figment, the dragon. He's here to learn and play. What else? Oh, my goodness. There is nothing Figment cat can do. <laughs> I almost said can do, but that's, that's not true. He's... Look at it, nothing but talent. Turn the flower to a bee. There is. Yeah. Oh, wow. The dragon. Does he? And can breathe underwater, apparently. I didn't know that. What a way to fill a day. There's no better way to fill a day than hanging out with Figment. Now, I'm a big fan of Figment. And when I learned that there is more to Figment than just his presence down at Epcot, well, (laughs) you better believe I jumped on that opportunity to explore all of this much deeper. Jeremy, come on. Come on, Jeremy. Yeah. Pull yourself together, Jeremy. We're supposed to write a story about dragons, right? Mm Mm-hmm. Well, I was just daydreaming about talking to a dragon. That's a very unique daydream to have. Why is everything so spooky? It's stormy outside. We're sitting by a fire. Get real. You can't talk to dragons. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa. (laughs) Oh, this is terrifying. Emma. Emma. (gasps) I come from a long line of dragons who dream. Yeah? It's a <laughs> well, family specialty. I think specifically, Emma. Emma, that's the dragon I was about Jeremy to was to. wondering if you daydream. I can't now, is a daydream different from a normal dream? I mean, clearly you're awake for one. I must be dreaming. You must be. But I don't care Why about that, you? Emma. I want to know if dragons Where dream. Why, you're at Figment's this house. Oh, of Figment where? Of imagination. That's me. That, yep, yeah, that's him. That Read his shirt. It says Figment. Magic of the mind. Oh. Magic that lets you go anywhere, anytime. I want to know that magic. We have to go home and write a story for school. What do you mean? A, we don't have time what? to talk to dragons. Yes, you do. The whole, but the Emma, whole thing, the whole paper is about dragons. Story. So why wouldn't you want to speak to a dragon, Emma? He is a dragon, you know. Yep, I'm with yeah, Jeremy on this. Oh, oh look at this. Good Good. This is. I want to go here. Authority on dragons. Who's the There's finest authority on dragons? Figment. Great. Great. Okay. Whoa. Tell me what you've done with your story so far. Nothing. Jeremy's just been staring off into space. <laughs> we started by going to the library, like yours here, Figment. But that's a library. I don't know if you can consider a bookshelf a library. Okay. Library, books, check, check. We read them. Yeah. Read. <laughs> this is... Then we started to write. What was Jeremy smiling at just there? But nothing. But nothing. Oh, take right away. That's when I said we should sit and write till something good came. But Jeremy mm. started imagining dragons. And yeah. here we are. <laughs> That's how I spent my days at school. Just imagining That's dragons. Just Daydreaming about dragons. think of a story. That's because stories begin here. Yeah? Where? In, in your treehouse? Oh, in the imagination. And you two just popped in a minute ago. Yeah? But ideas sometimes uh, take time. <laughs> yeah. But Figment, our story's due in the morning. Well, you guys should not have procrastinated. Then ready, 
Steady, go. Where are we going? Wait a minute. Go where? Yeah. See? <gasps> Pinocchio? What are you doing here? Oh, this just became so much more fun. Oh, heads up. I've never seen this before. <laughs> so, much like with every other classic cartoon commentary, it's flying off the cuff. Real-time reactions. I, I really, you know, I never considered that uh -oh, the figment, be this being a figment a cartoon, well, short, kind of, sure uh, they would implement other oh, Disney elements. Please. And I'm really excited to see that they have. Well, what was... The point of it, though. Sometimes the pictures in my mind are scary. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> that got real dark. Yeah, Pooh does have nightmares sometimes. sometimes. With heffalumps and woozles. Ah, woozles! So, I have this little trick. Yeah? I think night mare. Okay. Night reminds me that I was sleeping. Uh-huh. And mare, that's it's a, a horse. Yeah, I was right. The two together... <laughs> And it means I was asleep. You know what? That ran wild. A night horse. Oh, I get it. I get it now. It, like uh, running wild like and a horse. I, I, I was hard to follow for a minute. Because I know it wasn't real. Yeah. Wow, that's a great idea, Figment. Yep. I'll try it. Anytime you have a bad dream, just remember it's a wild what night horse. Kind of dreams are? <laughs> Nightmares. Daydreams. Oh. You know, well, hey, Jeremy, you're in luck. Kind of Dragons do daydream. With them, you have to be W I D E. Wide, Wide awake. Awake. Oh, okay. Ready to try? Yeah, sure. let's do this. Well, I guess. What do you mean you guess? Close your eyes. Okay. Eyes are Watch closed. Carefully. Uh huh. Listen closely. Got it. See what you can see. Okay. Through the power of words uh -huh. and the magic of your mind. Yep. You can be wherever you want to be. Man, I like this. I'm thinking Whoop. about everything getting big. Really but, big. Oh. I mean huge. Yeah, but that, I mean really huge. Does that mean you're getting small? Or is everything else getting big? I can't do it. Keep you know, Emma, trying. you are just a As sour Grandma patch kid, okay? Me, if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Try again. <sighs> what is this one? The rescuers? Not down under though. That's the first one, right? Wow. Oh, oh. Or is this down under? I'm imagining. It's great. Big are you imagining great. this? If you are, it's already been done. On the back of a big I think this would just be called remembering. Yeah? You didn't write the rescuers. Come on, Emma. You're just... That's it, Emma. Now, just imagine what you'd like to be. Who? You mean I can become whatever I want yeah. just by imagining it? Well, yeah. Sure. Take me. Okay. Take Whenever you where? I'm in a Saskatoon fresh kind of mood, S what? I just imagine myself ah, as one. That's a terrifying thing. Saska what was it that? Saska Saskatoon. Saskatoon. Saskatoon fresh. Yeah, I want to be a Saska fruity tooty too. Okay. <laughs> Give it a try. Saska fruity tooty too. Uh, you can't turn Give into a Saska fruity tooty too. Well, be quiet, Emma. I decided I don't like you. It's a harsh. Was your imagination ready? Yes. Check. Check. What was that? You don't know what these levers do, Jeremy. So. Don't touch that. Stop. Were you dreaming your own dream? Of being uh -oh. a Saskafrata tootie too? I guess I was dreaming your dream. It seems so neat How? to be a some Saska a Saskatoon frat. A Saskatoon frat. That's what it is. No, you didn't know that. Where? What is? How did? How was he able to read that data? From your heart. Well, Figment, my dream's kind of silly. What is? What's your dream, Jeremy? Can't be any sillier than a Fraska tootie tootie too. Okay, I'll try. Okay. Let's see. Mm hmm. Don't just remember a movie either, like Emma did. It's real, I see myself zooming through stars and planets. It's real, uh, into outer space. You know. I'm a cop I don't, I don't flying know. through the universe. It's dark out here. I'm getting I'm distracted by Jeremy's dream. I'm burning <laughs> up, <laughs> it's already that much more compelling than Emma's like remembering the rescuers. Isn't 
aren't the imagination wonderful? It really is. Now I see Earth. Okay. It's so beautiful. Yeah. It's all right. It's so quiet and peaceful. Quiet and peaceful. I want to stay here forever. You haven't been on Earth <laughs> much lately, have you, Jeremy? Oh, I'm back. I mean, you're back. I loved it up there, Figment. Essentially, you you back. you never There's left. No you dreamed about being space. on Earth, That's right? I know, oh, seeing Earth from space. Take it from a dragon who dreams. Nothing. Hey, it's a Sasuke Fruity Tutti Two again. Then I can go back for real. How? If we use our Just brains, stop I thinking. Come up with a storm. Ah. Ideas. A real brainstorm. <laughs> Figment. Saska Fratitude so too. Could, maybe I could jump right off the earth. Wait, what? We could blast out of a cannon. Well, hang on. This is this is getting out of hand. What why are we talking about cannons and blasting Jeremy off the earth? Catapult you off my tail. What? Catapult? What's happening? Are we going to war? Oh we're, we're going how about rocket ship? There we go. That will work, Emma. Where are we gonna find a it's gonna work better than a catapult. I mean, Jeremy, have you tried? You can be an astronaut, oh, use your imagination. You know what? Figment likes to imagine being an astronaut too. But becoming an astronaut will take years. I'll never get to outer space. What? what? How long do you anticipate you living, Jeremy? Jeremy? <laughs> You're what? still a kid. How can I make it happen? You guys believe uh, in, it, in the moon landing? <laughs> yeah, me too. Look, it's right there. Proof. The You're going to the moon? Vicky, what about me? I want to be a wizard like Merlin. There you wizard go, Emma. Anything. I like it. But I feel like I'll never get to be one. You can you be know a wizard. What a crummy dreamer I am. Yeah, you are kind of a crummy Everyone dreamer. Everyone can be a good dreamer. How? You love to read and write and study, just like Merlin, so you're already oh. halfway there. Well, there you go. All Anybody who likes to read, write, and study is halfway to being a wizard. To yourself as a wizard. Just close your eyes yep. and say the magic words with me. What are they? Watch closely, closely listen, listen carefully, uh -huh. see what you can see. Those are the magic words. And the magic in your mind, you can it's more of a magic phrase. No. Directions. I hear sound. That's a conductor. And I'm holding a baton. That's and I put it down. Want, music. And I bring it back you know, I was really music. on board with you becoming a wizard, a Emma. Conductor. That's a wizard of sound. Oh, there you go. Thanks for making it. <laughs> Make more sense, Figment. I can fit colors and yeah. shapes. Anything I want. Mm -hmm. Beautiful pictures. Oh, I get it. I'm an artist, Figment. Because a baton was like a wand. The paintbrush is like a wand. And colors. Okay. My head is so full of numbers. I'm inventing all kinds of concoctions. I mix this with that, and it turns into something completely different. <laughs> what is this I'm and that? A you mix blue and yellow to make green? Now I'm a writer. A <laughs> it says writer across her chest Emma, in case we Emma, were confused. Daydreaming. We have to finish this story. How's this? Once in a dream, we traveled to a place called Fagonia. Wait. Fagomia? Was that what that place was called? Dragonopolis. Yeah, Dragonopolis. I like okay. Fagomia much Once better than Dragonopolis. To a place called Dragonopolis. Although, once saying Dragonopolis, I kind of like that more now. No. No. Name Figment. That's Figment great. isn't orange with. Po about, Ugh. Um, he knew a lot about I don't like Emma. Being one himself. <laughs> Sorry, Emma. Really if you watch this. Was, do dragons dream? They do. <laughs> what? <laughs> I guess that was that. Oh. Uh, I, um. I'm not entirely sure what we learned, but I'm glad we went on this adventure together. Uh, I feel like I was a little hard on Emma, uh, so I apologize. I'm sorry, Emma. Jeremy was cool. He was a good guy. I don't know why in the end they started changing everything about Figment and Thagomia. I mean, the whole the story was written for them right there. Like, I guess it would be plagiarism plagiarizing 
if they just completely copied the whole event? Or would that just be recounting the event? I don't know. I'm kind of lost, but hey, I hope you dug it. And uh, again, if you want to learn more about Figment, go give a listen to our Radnorock retrospective where you learn everything you didn't know you wanted to know about Figment. Until next time, folks. Later.